Some people say these are 180 degrees out of phase and some people say they're not, they're one phase. Who is correct? The answer is yes, but let me give you my explanation. Here is a river. I couldn't find a real river, so we're gonna draw one. This river all flows in that direction and the river is 240 feet long. And Mr. Pirate on the shoreline would correctly say, this is one river flowing from my left to my right, all in one direction. There is no debate or confusion with that setup. Until Mr. Johnny Five here decides to build a bridge over the river in the middle, and he's going to live on the bridge. Now, Johnny says something different than Mr. Pirate. Johnny would say, there is not one 240-foot river flowing in one direction. There are two 120-foot rivers flowing in opposite directions. The river to my left is flowing towards me. The river to my right is flowing away from me. He would say, no, sir, it's one big river. There's the debate. The winding in your transformer goes like this. And we have one connection here, one connection here for 240 volts between them. And then we take a connection to the middle for the neutral. For 120 here, 120 here. The neutral is the bridge. So are the two halves of either side of the neutral in phase or out of phase? Are they going opposite directions or the same direction? It goes by your reference. If you're using the neutral as your reference, there are two rivers in opposite directions of half size. While it might be helpful for Johnny to have the knowledge that it is indeed one big river, for everything he builds, if he's going fishing, if he's building a dock, if he's gonna build his house, if he's gonna support the new bridge that he's building, everything he does, he has to react as though and treat it as though this current is flowing towards him and this current is flowing away from him. The fact that it's all going in one direction is good for him to know in case he is ever going to use the entire river. But he really has to act like it's two rivers. So when he is yelling, they're going in opposite directions, and he's like, they are not going in opposite directions. If they were going in opposite directions, your bridge would get overloaded because the water would be coming at you. The fact that it's going that way is proof that they're not going in opposite directions. All right, let's see how that lands. Thank you very much. I'm going to add these at the end to address comments trolls will leave and they don't make it to the end. Uh, yes, the river reverses directions, you know, 60 cycles a second. And the other thing trolls like to point out, the other thing I get in a lot of my videos from linemen or people who assemble transformers is the secondary that I draw is one piece. It functions as one piece, but during the assembly process, it comes in two pieces, but they can be linked in parallel if you want just 120 volts. But if you want 120 slash 240 volts, they get connected as one unit in series and the neutral connection goes to where the joint is between them. But that's still one secondary, one transformer winding or coil. Everybody in the comments says, oh, this is a coil, that's a winding. There's one secondary working together in series as one power source with the center tap. It doesn't matter that they come in two pieces while you're assembling them. It doesn't change electrically what's happening from different from what I drew. All right, thank you very much.